I bet you those aphids didn't know I had more seeds. They wreaked havoc on my garden. Absolute havoc. And they didn't know I had more seeds. I'm going to go out there. And I'm going to go plant more seeds. They're never going to win. Hi my friends, welcome to Farming on the Rock. Welcome to my channel. How are you doing? Is it raining where you are? Because it's raining cats and dog outside. Welcome to my channel. Alright, for those of you who saw my last video that I posted, the aphids, they are doing a number in the garden. But I am planning for them. I have more seeds, hence there is oak. So I'm... It's raining outside. I really wanted to take you out there, but to show you exactly where I'm going to plant these, I might be able to. Let's see how it goes. All right, so right here at the entrance of the garden, right at the entrance where my big tire is, there is nothing in there now. There were callaloo, and the worms destroyed those callaloo. So I have beans. Where are my beans? I have two type of beans, this one and that one. This is the, um, you pronounce that word, K word. So they're both green beans. So I'm going to put both of these in there. And um, yes, yeah, so those are going to go in the big tire. It's really heavily mulched. So they should do well in there. I am hoping. Now the cabbage that were in my three crates that the aphids destroyed. I think I'm going to put some. What should I put in there? I think I'm going to put some bell peppers. Because my bell pepper, they are getting old. So I might plant these bell peppers that I have in there. Those cabbages were so nice, it's so sad that I had to take them out, but that's, that's how it goes. Yeah. And then for the area that I had the sweet potato, the first set, those sweet potatoes, they didn't amount to much. I pulled up the, and I didn't remember to take the camera with me, I pulled up those sweet potatoes. I'm going to plant this in that container because my zucchini they are going out. I presently don't have any green ones that are producing, so I'm going to replant zucchini. Um, cucumber, I have very little cucumber producing right now, so we're right where I made the little makeshift what is that called? A trellis. I'm going to replant cucumber. Hopefully, they come. This, this variety normally do well so I'm going to plant that there and see how it goes at present I am having powdery mildew problem with cucumber but I'm still going to plant and hope for the best now in the raised bed that we built together that I had the lovely corns I am going to replant corn so I'm going to mulch that bed I have chicken manure that I was curing from earlier I'm going to use that and I'm going to replenish that bed and replant sweet corn no this is regular corn I presently do not have any sweet corn so I'm going to plant this there the corns outside they are doing well now so hopefully I and my baby is here as usual you're happy lovely I don't want you to be sad I have some butternut squash and I have luck with butternut squash. I'm going to plant some more. Not sure where yet. My butternut squash, they are doing fantastic at the minute. So proud of them. They are not being affected by anything yet. Knock on wood. <laughs> so I'm going to plant some more butternut squash. Um, I'm going to, I got two new sunflowers. 
my last one was something else i'm going to try with these in the garden as well not sure where yet so i'm gonna put those in right where i had um the beetroots in the oil container those i harvested those i didn't get the time to record either i'm going to put some onions there i planted onions in them before and they didn't do so bad so i'm going to do that again and see how it goes at the minute the aphids are eating away at my colored greens but i didn't know i had more seeds so i'm going to allow them to eat until they are they're contented and then i'm going to replant and i'm going to direct sow these hi sweetie i'm going to direct sow these and um and see how it goes that's how i did it the last time my lettuces they have all gone to seed so I'm going to sow lettuce seeds and I direct sow these and then thin them out. You can look at um, all of the lettuce there. They've all gone to seed. And we enjoy our lettuce every day in our sandwiches or salads. So. And these come really quickly. So by, by you say, Udeya. That's what Jamaicans would say. These are up and ready again. If it's totally wiped out my pak choy, I am still in this belief. But luckily I have seeds. These come really, really quickly. So I'm going to re-sow and um, replant my pak choy. So I'm not going to be disheartened for long. It is disheartening, I can't lie, but I will re-sow these and in a couple of weeks I'll have pak choy again to eat and to share the aphids are also doing a number on my red cabbages usually they don't attack the red cabbage I'm not sure why they are attacking them but as I say once you have seeds there is oak so I'm going to re-sow some red cabbages as well as well as some green ones I have the seeds somewhere here in this <laughs> container so I have way more seeds than they expect me to have those aphids so annoying yes yeah, so I'm going to replant my red cabbages these take a very long time to come though but I have other stuff that I can eat while these take their sweet time to grow now when it's not one thing it's the other so the worms not the aphids this time the worms took out my callaloo I got a lot from it though so what my husband suggests is that I plant them in small, um, small amounts all over the garden. Because what we notice is the ones that are planted single, they are not attacked. We have those eating. So I'm going to plant these all over in empty containers that I have out there. As it relates to the herbs that I planted with you recently, I'm not sure if my patients or the seeds just didn't germinate, but for the containers that I'm not seeing anything going on in. I am seeing the red basil and I'm seeing this basil. This one didn't grow. Or I'm seeing one of the basils. But for the ones who didn't sprout, I am going to re-sow in the same containers just in case the seeds take a long time to germinate. So I have a picture of where I planted what. I'll just re-sow those herbs. I will be replanting as soon as the rain allows me to. I'm, I think I'm going to find somewhere to plant some turnip. Not sure where yet. And I'm going to sow some more um, cayenne pepper. I have just a few seeds left in there. Alright, so thank you for joining me today. I appreciate your company as always. Thank you to my subscribers and to my viewers. Thank you so much for being there and for supporting the channel. If you have not yet subscribed, please go ahead and subscribe, like, share, leave a comment. Let me know what you think. Remember, the more you share, the more YouTube pushes out this video to other persons who might be interesting. So go ahead and share with your friends because if you like my videos, chances are they will like them too. Alright, bye-bye.